this is a short follow-up review video of my previous review of the Schwalbe Pro 1 tubeless tire We're looking at the rear tire this one I've been riding it for a bit more now this one has 8,000 kilometers on it now and it's about to be replaced I already replaced the front tire which had more cuts in it and this one now can't really hold pressure above four or five bar and um well actually kind of four i just um, hooked up the pump and i rode it two days ago and just by putting it on i got four bar i'll pressure it up again and to about six or seven and hope that I managed to I have to put the camera down for a second sorry about that okay that's 100 psi in there now still seems okay for the moment Take this off. Puff. You know, a couple of rides ago, two or three rides, I pumped it up to six bar left, and only a few hundred meters later did the uh, uh, cut break and the um, milk was spraying out. Took about a minute or two until it sealed. I stopped and made sure that the, the hole was at the bottom rotated the wheel once or twice then put it at the bottom again I'm pretty sure if I start riding now same thing will happen so I'm gonna stop the video now and see if it pop, pops in the next few minutes in the meantime we're looking at the front tire which I replaced about a thousand kilometers ago and as you can see it already has some cuts and we have a kind of a wet or damp patch here and it also has some some other cuts. I mean, this stuff just happens. Ah, and just as we talk, you can watch the pressure drop now. Here it comes the sealant. You really need to put it at the bottom so the sealant can reach the, the hole. And now it's already sealed. Ah, not quite. But we lost a lot of pressure now. It's definitely still rideable. Probably down to about four bar again, what we started off with. Anyway, sealed, that's tubeless for you. However, I will replace this tire now.